And it is for the 24-7 Championship! And here comes one of my favorites! Introducing the challenger, representing the Outsiders from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 204 pounds, Blaze! This is it, guys. The title is up for grabs here. And this might be the most highly anticipated title defense in recent memory. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Oh, 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 are you guys ready? And introducing the champion, representing Team Cobra from San Juan, Puerto Rico, weighing in at 228 pounds, the 24-7 champion, Cole Brock Dynamite! Of course, the title is on the line in this one, guys. And don't be surprised if history is made here tonight. I know the champ has looked good as of late, but I'd say the opposition has looked just as good, if not better. The hottest potato in WWE being contested, the 24-7 championship. It's the best title ever, Michael. What other championship has been won by both me and Corey? Correction, Saxton. I won it. You stole it. Headbutt. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. I able to counter. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Able to give him the slip. Ooh, kick to the face. Boom, right across the small of the back. He's just getting thrown around out here. He's got to reevaluate his approach at this point. Oh, there's the old stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? <laughs> Arm ringer applied. Oh, my goodness. That might have snapped a finger. Tearing the champion apart as best they can. That could factor into the result of this match. Power from the suplex. into the ring from the floor now. Handspring. Nice. Hard whip into the corner. Into the corner, shotgun drop kick. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Taking it outside the ring now. 
And what kind of superstar is typically favored in a tables match? The smart ones. It takes a surprising amount of planning to put someone through a table. If you can improvise, you're going to be in good shape. Boom! The challenger is not in a great place. Might want to start setting up some tables before this match gets out of hand. Climbs back inside. Float over. Oh, and it's DDT! Fight. Oh my god! Just whipped into the table. He's setting up the table in the corner. This isn't gonna be good. He's heading back to the ring. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Jumping clothesline! What agility! And he has free reign to the outside with no countouts to worry about. Heading back to the ring. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Drop kick right to the knee. Right on the patella. Directly on the knee, right on target. That's what you got to do to get to the champ. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Foot, meet face. Able to sidestep it. He's got the answer for that one. Trying to work the arm. Now in control. But this opponent still fighting back. Denied with an elbow. shift into the tides with this championship match. I thought the defending champion had this well in hand, but the new champ had other plans. It just goes to show you anything can happen in WWE.